Hello, everybody, and welcome to Accident the Pilot. This is a uh, free demo of the game that will be releasing soon enough, and it's called Accident. And uh, I know this has been out for a little bit, um, but I was waiting for some things uh, that they did fix. You can now go into options, and you can now go to video, and you can change your resolution, which every time I launch this game, they put it in 640 by 480. 25, 60, 14, 40, 144. Thank you. We appreciate it. Well, who knows if that worked? Let's go ahead and click on accidents and get started, shall we? We've got a virtual crash test lab tutorial. It's going to teach us some things. Uh, 1145 test subject 45 victims dummy dummy starting the simulation we're putting that in our uh, laptop with the oh we're putting our VR headset on and oh my okay sometimes a description of a grayed out interaction contains clues on how to enable it and you can actually hear the CD-ROM running oh that brings back some memories oh we are virtual crash test lab oh hit the brakes okay we're okay we didn't die how about that? What do we have here? Uh, new objectives. Call the emergency. Um, I know you have to act quick, so let's do that. Get the get the smartphone. Call them up. Call them up. Yep. One one two. Hey, we've got it. We got it. We got a problem here. Um, can we get out of the car? Can we get out of the car? Uh, I'm panicking. Don't panic. That's the first thing you shouldn't do. Is panic. Oh, we have a fire. Oh my God. Thank you for the call. I'll guide you through this tutorial. For other instructions, look at the video screens. Okay, turn on the hazard lights. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're worried about right now. We have a fire, people. Oh my God, put the phone, yeah, put the fire out. Get out, secure the area. Hey, remember, don't panic. Where's our, uh, Where's who has a fire extinguisher? Do you have a fire extinguisher? You have a fire extinguisher in the back of your car? Nope. All right, put out the fire. We're, we, well, I would love to. We have to come over here um, and uh, get a fire extinguisher. Yep, that's what we need to do. Hit the button. Give us our fire extinguisher. There we go. Put the fire out. Okay. Well, it wasn't that bad, I guess, was it? No, it wasn't that bad. Come on. Put it out. Put it out. Put it out. Let's charge when you need him. Oh, it's almost out. Nicely done. New objectives. Mark accident location with warning triangle. Okay. Well, we'll do that. Uh, it's this. This is starting to make sense to me where they want it. Back here. Uh, okay. Back here. Oh, we got people on the ground over here. Uh, turn off ignition in the red car. All right. Let's do that. Uh, boom, get you, get you, get you on out, get you on out. Okay. Yep. Get inside the red car. We need to get the, uh, turn off the ignition. Okay. Good Lord. That took that dude forever to get out of the car. Wow. Assess the situation. Uh, check all victims. All okay. right. How are you doing? Dummy one or dummy two. I don't know what your name is. Um, check for consciousness. Okay. So, uh, that's over here. It looks like gently, uh, shake the, by the shoulder there. Um, hello, hello, you there? Check the breathing. Oh, you gotta hold it down. Okay, check the breathing. The dummy's breathing. That's actually scary. I don't like this at all. Okay, um, check out oh, for the wound. Uh, injuries, a wound there as well. Okay, so now that was one, and then we have another victim over here. Uh, as you can see right there, they're showing you what to do. Isn't that nice? All right, uh, we know what to do now. Sir, can you hear me? Let me shake you. Don't shake the baby. Uh, check the breathing instead. Okay, yep. I don't know why a dummy would be. Help the victims. You've made a mistake. You can rewind time to a previous stage. If you did. We didn't make a mistake. Uh, press and hold the rewind button. Um, help the victims. Okay. Gotcha. Then wait until the time turns back to your desired stage and release the button. Okay, so that's, uh, R. Okay, we did all of that. You happy now? Let's help the victims out, right? Let's actually help them out now that we have rewound time back. Uh, grab the first aid kit. Some grayed out interactions can be enabled by other actions. Okay. Not worried about it. First aid to you. Wow. Look at this. We're going to open this thing up by double clicking there. Um, okay. Put on the gloves. We will do that. Let's put them on. Open the airway. Uh, that's over here. There's the airway there. Open the airway up. Got to hold it down so we can do that. Uh, and then apply the CPR mask. Okay. Put that on there and perform CPR by clicking here. Chest compressions. There we go. And we go, oh, it's like a mini game, it looks like. Tempo 100 to 120. Let's start. There we go. We got it now. Get it. Get it. Get it. Boom. Perfect. 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 We're playing, uh, what you call it? New high score. It is a mini game. 
<laughs> I thought we were playing DDR there for a second. Okay, they want us to do it twice. So now we do artificial ventilation, it looks like. Count of two. Oh, full breaths. Full breaths. One, two. We gotta go all the way up, all the way down. There we go. Check the breathing. Are you breathing? You were breathing before. I don't know why we're doing CPR on you, but uh, it's okay. All right, perfect. That's it. We have learned so much today. Oh, maybe not. It's not over. Discover the cause. In this extra stage, your job is to collect relevant evidence and figure out what was causing the accident. Okay, well, uh, which was the cause of the accident. Uh, debris, let's go ahead and look at that clue. This is the third piece of evidence. Um, we got something over here. Uh, we got something over here. We got a rock, okay. Uh, and then we've got this debris as well. Second piece of evidence, perfect. Put the events in the correct order with F. All right, organize the events. Number one would be the muffler. Okay, number two would be this debris. Number three would be the tire and four would be smashing into the rock. So finish the scenario. Scenario finished, success. Dummy, this is just a dummy. He's dead? Why did he, they're both dead? I saved their lives. Well, they are dummies. They're, they're not really alive, right? Yeah, of course. Take that headset off and let's keep on a working, shall we? We'll go to the next one. We completed that. Uh, Swedish countryside in Kronenberg County in Sweden, October 3rd, 2016, time of day, 1230. First responders, August, uh, August Nilsson, Jacob Haraldson, Ingolf Holt, Suzanne Olander, and August Olander. We got August and August. Okay, cool. We click on the little uh, simulation. Let's do it. Let's go back to that day. It says to call the ambulance as soon as you can. The sooner they arrive, the more chances the victims have. Okay. Kronenberg County in Sweden, October 3rd, 2016. Oh, that's a bump. Yep. What's going on up here? What a beautiful day to be out in the road. Uh, I can't drive. Uh-oh, we got trouble a brewing up here. What is this? Oh, there's a person on the ground. Okay. Remember, don't panic. We learned this in the simulation. Don't panic. Okay, call emergency. Okay, hazard lights are on. Uh, okay, don't don't panic, Jeff. Don't. There's the phone. There's the phone. Use the phone. Call him immediately. Hey, we have a wreck here. Um, call emergency services. We're doing it right now. Okay. Uh, we don't know what's going on further than this. There's a truck. There's a car. Can you please come? Thank you for calling. The ambulance is on its way. Please stay on the line. Okay, secure the area. Get out. Uh, turn off the ignition in the vehicles. Zero of three. Okay, remember we learned that. Oh my God! There's a person on the ground. Okay, uh, okay, we're we're not gonna we're not gonna panic. Okay, let's get into here. Let's get the uh, ignition. Get inside. Oh my God! There's blood everywhere. Okay, uh, ignition. There we go. All right, cool. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Uh, glove compartment. Put out the fire. But I want to put out the fire. Is there something in here? It's locked. How do I get out? Oh, there it is, right there on the edge. Put out the fire. There's a fire. What is happening? Is there? You have something back here? Locked. Do I have something in my car? I bet I have a fire extinguisher in my car, don't I? I do, I do, okay. I was about to say. Where's the fire? There's the fire over here. Oh my God, yes, this is on fire. This looks terrible. This looks, hopefully there's nobody in this car. Oh my God, there's two people in the car. Okay. I would be terrible at uh, this in real life. Okay, I'm trying to, let's calm down. Let's calm down, let's put the fire out. Okay. Can you hear me? Are you okay? Oh my God, we're out of extinguisher. You have anything in yours? Oh, of course you do. Why wouldn't you? Put it out. Put it out. Oh my God. This is a mean fire. Look at that on the ground. Okay. The nope. The fire's coming back with a vengeance. Fire was coming back with a vengeance. Okay. We're good. Mark accident location. Zero of two. Um, okay. Uh, okay. I remember. The, yeah. Okay. I remember this one, the simulation, the, the triangles. Uh, it's nice that they have equipment in their cars too. Uh, I don't even think I have that in my, in my, in real, in real life. I, do, do you, you keep an emergency triangle in your car? Maybe it's required by law. Okay. Yep. We got that one. Come on, dude. You got to run a little faster than this. We have, we have a horrible situation unfolding right now, uh, on our hands. And this is terrible. Put that down. Okay. Turn off the ignition of the vehicles. One, three. Uh, we only did one and then that fire erupted. So I couldn't do anything else. Okay, um, let's go ahead and, uh, one of three. There's three vehicles. There's a truck here. Is there a person in the truck? Um, okay. Um, hey, anybody in here? 
Where is the driver? Oh my God, please tell me. That's the driver on the ground. Oh my, okay. Ignition's off. Okay, get out. Dude, are you kidding me right now? That dude got ejected. That's what it looks like to me. Oh my, is there a kid in here? What is going on right now? It's jammed. Hey, can you hear me? Can you hear me? I need to get in there. I need to get in there. Uh, driver's door's jammed. Oh, we got the ignition from the window being busted open. Check all victims, zero of four. Uh, okay, well, let's start with the kid. Uh, okay, dude, you okay? You are not okay. Uh, remember this, the simulation told us this. Uh, check for breathing. Okay, uh, that looks terrible. Uh, check in the breathing. Um, okay, checked all victims. He's, thank you really that information. Yep, okay. You, you alive? Ma'am, can you hear me? Nope. Okay, uh, check for breathing down here. Unbuckle the seatbelt. That would probably help. Open the airway. No, don't drop her back onto the, oh my God. A wound is on her neck. That's not good. Check the breathing. I don't hear her breathing. I don't hear her breathing. That's terrible. Okay, um, check all victims. Okay, that was one. Let's get back to this dude that was ejected from the vehicle. My God, dude, are you okay? Are you okay? You do not look okay. Can you hear me? Sir, can you hear me? Uh, open the airway. We're gonna check for the breathing. Okay. He is breathing. He is breathing currently right now. There's a wound. Um, that's the injuries that we can see there for now. And oh my God, what a laceration down there. Um, terrible. Okay, awesome. Uh, back into here, let's check on this dude. Dude, sorry, I didn't have time to check on you before. I, w I wanted to, but they told me to not do it yet. Oh my God, dude, that looks terrible. It's, it, it's not bad at all. Can you hear me? Open the airway. You okay? Checking for breathing. Oh, this is a stressful game. Uh, injuries. And you know time counts here. There's a wound. Okay, yeah. Okay. Check your exact location. Getting out of here is like a nightmare. Uh, check your exact location. What does that even mean to check my exact location? All right, thank God for rewinding time because checking your exact location is this. You have to get into the car and then you hit the little thing right here. How dumb is that? Get out of here. Get, get out. We've checked our exact location. That's where we're located, okay? We have people dying in here and there's nothing we can do. Get out, help the victims. Now start with the child. Give him five initial breath. That girl's gone. She gone girl. Look at the very bottom there. Uh, thank you, really the information to the paramedics. Yeah, we'll try. Uh, can we get him out of the car? Is he dead? What is going on here? Okay, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, here he is right here. Uh, first aid kit, first aid kit. We remember this. Remember, we need this. Uh, there he is. First aid. Yep. Get that. Open it up. Put those gloves on. Remember, we got to do that. Um, CPR mask is, I believe, uh, open the airway. There we go. Open the airway. CR, CPR mask goes to there. This is this is nuts, man. Uh, artificial breath. Remember, we go all the way up. Down. This is what we trained for. Come on. Save this life. Hang in there, damn it. Don't you die on me. Okay, that's good. Uh, check the breathing. We're checking for breathing. He's alive. He's alive. Perform CPR, and we don't have to do that. Recovery position. All right, pick up the CPR mask. Uh, whatever this is. Okay, okay. Uh, I didn't even know what that even meant. Um, okay, you go over here. I didn't even know there was a recovery position. You learn something new every day. How about that? Okay, are we good? Nope. Open the airway. He's good to go. He's alive. Kid's alive. Can we run the next one? Uh, she gone, girl, though. We know that. I mean, that's, you can't remove her. Okay, jammed. She just, yeah, she toast. Let's get here to this dude. Uh, let's help him out. Too dangerous to move. Okay, do you have a, you have anything? Let me get my first aid kit. Actually, I still have that first aid kit on me. I am like freaking out here, man. I'm freaking out. Too dangerous to move. And I can't use that. Okay, so no on that one. What about you? Can we, can we help you out at all? Uh, not sure what we got to do, but uh, trapped by seatbelts. Get, get the seatbelt off him. There we go. Get, pull him out of the car. All right. He's out on the ground. He's out on the ground. Uh, get that first aid kit out. Yep. First aid. Administer first aid. Let's get this open. Uh, open the airway in a second here. Let's get our gloves on first. There we go. There we go. CPR mask goes on to him. There we go. Let's do it. Perform CPR. Zero of two. Oh, we got to play the game. We got to play the game. Here we go. Lost in an There we go. Come on. Hang in there. Don't you die on me, damn it. 
New high score. Don't care. Did he live? Did he live? That is what we want to know right now. 39,880. Don't care about the score. Don't care. We have lives here, people. Okay. Put that away. Uh, here we go. Got that. Okay. Awesome. Check for breathing. He toast. He toast. We tried. We tried. He dead. He definitely dead. Oh, ambulance on scene. Ambulance is on scene. Finally. Good Lord. Took him forever to get here. Nearly wrecked it. Don't hit the kid. Oh my God. I know the kid's sitting over there. They run him over. I hope they didn't. Okay. Discover the cause. Gather all the clues. Okay. Ambulance is on scene. We don't have to be. Uh, oh, what's this? What puddle? Irrelevant. Okay. We got over here. Got uh, footprints. Oh, a boar stands in the road. Oh, okay. Uh, tire marks, skid marks. Yep. And golf Holt changes lanes to avoid the animal. Oh. Oh, so that's how this happened. Okay. Well, we'll see. Anything else further down here? Got puddles, irrelevance, puddle irrelevance. Anything over here? Uh, I don't know how far out they want us to go. So yeah, you can uh, go up in here into the woods and stuff. It's like open uh, world. That's actually cool. I was expecting that to be kind of like closed off, you know? Um, okay, we got something here. Got skid marks, irrelevant. Uh, yeah, blood stains, irrelevant. We've got an impact point. That's a clue. Okay. Collision with an oncoming truck because they avoided an animal. I think that's what happened. And then something happened here. Uh, we got irrelevant. Okay, the kid is put away. Skid marks. There's the other one. Okay. Susan Olander breaks and collides with the trail. Susan's dead. I don't think there's anything we could do about that, honestly. Six clues total. Okay, what's uh, anything back here? That's going to tell the story better. The broken windshield is a clue. Okay. Jacob Haraldson is ejected through the windshield. Yeah, I was afraid of that. That is uh, exactly what happened. We have one more clue we have to find. Close that door. Uh, what is left here? Aha! There's the clue. Seatbelt. Truck driver not wearing a seatbelt. Man, that took me forever to find that one. Okay, well, we have all of them now. Now all we have to do is just put this whole thing together and figure out what exactly happened. Let's organize the events. So we know that uh, a boar stands in the road. Number two, here comes the uh, avoiding of the animal. Uh, and then smash. Boom. We have a collision with an oncoming truck. We know that the driver was not wearing a seatbelt. And we know that they went through the windshield and that uh, she was not paying attention uh, and she collided in the back end of the trailer. That was what happened. Yep, got a success on it. Jacob Haraldson lives to tell the tale alive. After careful examination of the hospital, Jacob Haraldson was diagnosed with spinal injury. He underwent emergency surgery after which he had to complete several months of rehabilitation to be able to walk again. Currently, Jacob works as a security guard and blah, 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 blah. Who cares? Um, Ngoff suffered significant blood loss due to this, uh, the laceration we, on the arm and the piece of glass. Uh, fortunately, your CPR saved his life and the paramedics stopped the bleeding. The wounds healed quickly, but the glass severed several nerves. Oh, that sucks. Uh, yeah, she dead. Gone girl. Uh, when Suzanne's car hit the back of the trailer in the bumper, smashed it over the front window, hit her head and... Killing her instantly. There's nothing you or the paramedics could do. She was buried a week later. Okay. August Olander, alive. Kid uh, lived. Uh, went into shock. Results in coma. He suffered several minor internal injuries after five weeks. Man, what a grim game. What a grim, grim, gr grim game. Uh, accident and death of his mother traumatized him severely. Yeah, we didn't need to know he needed therapy after that. Come on. You, like We didn't have to go into those details, did we? Uh, I mean, come on. Thank you for playing Accident the Pilot. Be sure to check out the full game on Steam, available quarter three of 2020. Uh, once it comes out, we're definitely going to play it. Look at those uh, shots. That's it, It's it's a unique game. Uh, you know, it's a puzzle game. And uh, it, was, it was grim. It was morbid. It was weird in some ways, but enjoyable. Let me know what you thought in the uh, comments below. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care.